academic excellence on Peralta News. I had not been in a classroom since I graduated uh, sixth grade. Following my first semester at um, BCC, my family was evicted from our apartment. I thought we were moving around a lot before, now we were moving around pretty frequently, like every month, two months or so. I would leave to go to school in the morning and home wouldn't be in the same place, you know, when I came back. It just made me that much more dedicated to school. It was kind of the only thing I had control of. There were times I was eating like one muffin a day. The scholarships, it's not an exaggeration to say they saved my life, or at least made it phenomenally better. Prior to that, everything had been, I don't know, I don't even know how to explain it. Um, everything was so stressful, it was hard to focus on anything. The scholarships helped me not worry about getting food. They helped me not worry about where I was gonna stay. School became my rallying point, my way to change my circumstances. Community at BCC is so tight-knit. You know, we get to know each other very well. Faces become very familiar. And we kind of become invested in each other's success. And they constantly encouraged me and kept saying, you can do it, keep aiming higher and higher. And that helped pick me up, you know, whenever I was feeling down, whenever I felt like I'd run my last lap or thrown my last punch, you know. They said, no, you got more in you, keep it up, keep going. And that's, I think, um, it's crucial. It really is crucial. I would like to help underserved adolescents. Right now I'm studying psychology. I'm interested in going to grad school after this. The things we achieve are recognized, especially by this district and by others. Uh, this is the place to start, you know. The Peralta system makes things very accessible, makes things very possible, as you can see. Um, and it can be done if you're willing to put in the work, if you're willing to, to try. Thank you for watching Academic Excellence on Peralta News.